Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Piss Texans at their border right now with insane surprise for horde of invaders coming any day. Texas isn't taking any chances with the over 1,000-person army of illegal invaders who are marching toward America right now and forcing their way over the border. President Donald Trump has issued several warnings about the caravan that's coming and can't be stopped and was ignored. He threatened Mexico to do something about these invaders or face financial consequences. They too refused to act as this army made further advancement toward America. Now that they are almost here, Texans are going to extreme measures to protect their great state from being the port of entry for these mostly Honduran invaders who plan to force their way in and have a list of demands they're bringing with them. It's unclear where this caravan plans to illegally cross into America from Mexico, but with Texas as one of the largest options, the state is making sure that's not going to be an option. Of course, there's always California who will likely roll out the red carpet for these illegals, making it easy to enter, but maybe a little more challenging to get to. Less than 24 hours after Trump announced that he will be sending our military to protect vulnerable parts of the border, Texas Governor Greg Abbott announced what they are doing now. Conservative Tribune reports, as a caravan of more than 1,000 migrants makes its way across Mexico with the hopes of entering the United States, how and where those migrants enter the country remains unknown. It is assumed officials in California will welcome them should they attempt to enter the country there, but Texas Governor Greg Abbott has other plans should they hope to enter via his state. In a tweet posted Sunday, Abbott sent out a reminder that it's not just U.S. Customs and Border Patrol agents manning the entry points to Texas. He's also deployed National Guard troops, Abbott said. The caravan, first reported by BuzzFeed News, reportedly consists of up to 1,200 migrants, many of which are from Honduras. Organized by a group of volunteers called Pueblos Sin Fronteras, or People Without Borders, the caravan is intended to help migrants safely reach the United States, bypassing not only authorities who would seek to deport them, but gangs and cartels who are known to assault vulnerable migrants wrote BuzzFeed reporter Adolfo Flores, who is traveling with the caravan. President Trump isn't the only one harping on this impending issue and why it's important to stop it. Appearing on Fox and Friends on Monday, former Secret Service agent and Maryland congressional candidate Dan Bongino described this incoming invasion as complete, total, utter chaos. There is a consequence for us, Americans who have to finance this chaos, Bongino said. You can't have a country without borders. It's just a landmass without the borders. Trump isn't all talk, as we've seen with him making good on all of his campaign promises so far. Protecting the border is more important now than ever and he, like the great state of Texas, are doing just that. It's not just a threat, it's a promise. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.